Hi, I'm Kelly McGuire with the TMC Newsroom, and here are today's top stories. Jumpbuck Entertainment has reportedly announced the availability of its mobile chat and flirt service called PowerChat for users of BlackBerry smartphones. Users of PowerChat from BlackBerry smartphones can now access a diverse mobile community consisting of millions of people around the world, including people who are not only using BlackBerry smartphones. With PowerChat, users can immediately access a massive mobile community for chatting and sharing photos. It features public chat rooms, which include theme rooms, such as singles, friends, dating, world chat, and also regional and age-specific rooms. PowerChat allows users to check out other chatters' photos in chat rooms, and they can also select a chatter to see profile information and more photos. Also, users can send messages directly to specific chatters. In addition to allowing one-to-one -one chats, PowerChat helps users keep, excuse me, keep a track of friends and see what their favorite chatters are online. Also, users can upload photos stored on the BlackBerry smartphones or take an instant photo for upload. Currently, the carriers that are offering Jumbox PowerChat include AT&T, Verizon Wireless, Sprint, T-Mobile, Virgin Mobile, and many others. PowerChat is now available to download at BlackBerry Smartphone App World. Ensa Technologies, or Ensa Tech, which makes enterprise communication software, has just launched a version of its mobile unified communication software for Google Android OS devices. The mobile UC software, titled Mobile UC Client, reportedly delivers fixed to mobile convergence for a wide range of wireless devices with enterprise PBX systems, such as Cisco, Avaya, Nortel, Asterix, and many others. It provides a complete communications and collaboration solution for mobile users, integrating presence, messaging, mobility, and commuter excuse me, computer telephony to users over their mobile devices. Representatives at Ensatech said that the integration of unified communications with, excuse me, with wireless devices will dramatically increase the ability of mobile users to connect to their office and be able to communicate as if they were sitting at their desks. Ensatech has released a version specifically for Google Android users so they can link their device to their office telephone system and leverage the mobile device as their office communication device. A new market research report titled Green Energy in the U.S., Renewable Investment, Capacity Growth, and Future Outlook discusses how the United States performed in 2008 in terms of renewable energy. In terms of new capacity installed during 2008, the report found that the, excuse me, the United States was the largest energy market with 8,346 megawatts, following the U.S. as China, then India, Germany, Spain, and lastly Italy. According to the report, the United States leads the world in geothermal energy use, with a total installed capacity at year-end 2008 of 3,043.3 megawatts. And, with hydropower accounting for 5.8% of the world's electricity supply, the report found that the U.S. ranked fourth in hydropower usage in 2008. For the year, the total generation of electricity in the U.S. was 4,110 billion kilowatt hours, primarily dominated by the coal market with roughly 48.5% of U.S. electricity coming from coal-fired plants. Natural gas-fired plants contributed 21.3% to the total U.S. electricity generation, followed by nuclear plants with 19.6%. Additionally, the report analyzes types of energy volumes, capacity installed, and generation output across the U.S. With recent trends coming out of the green technology sector, the report discusses the projected forecast up until 2020 based on many current industry trends to date. That's all for today. For more information, please visit www.tmcnet.com. I'm Kelly McGuire with the TMC Newsroom, and thanks for watching.